Now, your weekly Wolfpack Sports Update, brought to you by News First 5. Hi, I'm Lee Douglas with your weekly Wolfpack Sports Update. CSU Pueblo's baseball team continued its hot streak last week, winning a series from Regis three games to one and winning its seventh and eighth games to jump within three games of the RMAC Mountain Division lead. Now, the high point of the weekend series was a gem pitched by sophomore Jeremiah Strubel, who three hit the Rangers in a four zip masterpiece for his second consecutive complete game win. Strubel and the Thunder Wolves will try to make it 11 of 12 this weekend when they take on the Colorado School of Mines in Golden. The pack track team was on display last week as CSU Pueblo hosted the second annual CSU Pueblo Invitational Track Meet. And the story of the meet was the performance put on by Danita Wyatt. Danita broke a school record with a 40 foot, two and a half inch triple jump, smashing the 19 year old mark by more than two feet. She also ran the back leg of the pack's four by 100 meter relay team, which took second in the meet, but broke a two week old mark with a time of 4667. Both marks were provisional qualifiers for the national championships. Well, the CSU Pueblo men's and women golf team headed to Phoenix last week for the RMAC Spring Championships, and the returns were very positive for the Pac golfers. The women started strong, placing second after one round. They fell back to fourth overall. They were led by freshman Dama Dinalo who was 18 over for the tournament and finished sixth. CSU Pueblo finishes the season ranked third in the Rocky Mountain Athletic Conference standings. It's the highest finish ever for the Pac women. But the big story was the performance of the men's golf team. The Pac men broke school records for best individual round team score and tournament team score. The Pac men won the RMAC Spring Championship with an amazing 29 under par claiming its first RMAC Tournament Championship since 2004. Leading the pack was Pueblo native Junior Chad Novak. He shared the individual title with a 12 under par performance for his first ever tournament win. The men, like the women, finished the season ranked third in the RMAC standings, and they will continue their season at the NCAA Regionals the first week of May. That's going to do it for now. We're back next week with another Wolfpack Sports Update. I'm Lee Douglas.